Hey friends, Squeaks here. We're at the Switch border today in Super Quote Unquote Mario World. And let's see what we got. Weird. Oh, okay, so I'm assuming if I did not hit a Switch Palace, I would be out of luck. Due to the certain plumbers trying to save the princess, re-swab orders to make a gap that plumbers could not jump across. <laughs> Getting to the yellow Switch Zone could make these blocks solid, thus making it possible to get past. If you have already done it, just go. See, I did do it, but, um... I believe it didn't save, I guess, because I died. I thought it would have saved after the Switch Palace, but um, I'm pretty sure that I I did this. This was the Yellow Switch Zone. So I guess we get a second chance now to... Ah, uh... oh, crap. Um, no, it should be good still. Nope, and I lost it. That was dumb of me. But, uh... Oh, so close to being able... I really want that. Just because I know I can never have it if I leave. I feel like I can just barely touch it. Oh my god, one of those jumps was close, but... That Kudos Moon will forever elude us, friends. It's too bad. Yes, 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 we get yellow. So, didn't this ask me to save? No? I guess not. Alright, so we're back to the switch border. So that's kind of cool. Is this the... Yeah, why is this the underwater music? I'd noticed that the first time, but I just... I guess I didn't... Uh, interpret how weird it was. Oh! Moob Moob's castle. Who is Moob Moob? Oh my, I thought you would walk right into that block. I didn't realize it was part of the background. <laughs> Almost got myself smushed. Okay, little dry bone. I still think you're adorable. Oh, you're kind of cute too, giant thwomp. Why do you have such, like... Those cheeks. The cheeks are really strange on those thwomps. The way they curve in. The mischievous little cartoon kid smile. <laughs> Quite strange. Ah... Uh... Darn it. And we'll get rid of him. Bounce, bounce. Alright. We should be able to get through here relatively safely. Damn it. Yeah, those are not real thwomps. They're part of the background layer, so you cannot spin jump off them like you normally would. Well, once I get in spin jump mode, I start spin jumping everywhere. <laughs> Strange looking, uh... What are those things called? The big ones? I don't remember. One of them... The little ones are a little sparky. The big one is like... Oh, it's got a weird name. I can't remember what it is right now. Cannot remember. You'll have to watch the credits of Super Mario World if you're curious. <laughs> okay, that wasn't too bad. See, that's what I mean. The level was kind of challenging. Not like super challenging, but like on the difficulty curve. And it was just long enough. That it wasn't, um, overbearing. Oh, poor little Iggy. Or Moob Moob. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Alright, so what do we got? Mario has made it past the rock-solid castle of Moob Moob. Once again, Mario collects another egg, which appears to be a baby Goshi egg. Mario now heads to some nearby islands. Well, that should be fun. Unless we get a lot of water levels. Oh my god, we should take a look at this overworld. How do you do that again? Not with that button. We'll take a look at it next time we're on there. When we die very s I thought for sure that guy was gonna kick a, uh... the shell at me. Which, it looks a lot like the shells when you get the, uh, funky exit in the regular game. But it's just a background thing that apparently means a mushroom's hidden in it. It looks like that's what the, they chose to use. That's kind of a cool use, I guess. Having an object that means this spawns a mushroom instead of just hiding them in random bushes and shit. That's nice, I like that. Oh. <laughs> you really don't need a lot of speed to get going on those things. Okay. Get rid of you. Hey, we got a one-up. That was close. Oh, and a checkpoint. Lovely, lovely checkpoint. <laughs> I don't know how I missed that. Oh my god. Yay. 
I should have used him to get back up on there. Although I could probably just run for it, because I didn't check if that pipe had something I could go in. Oh, I did not get running speed like I thought I would. Nope. This was just coins, yeah. Alright. Moving forward. Stomp on that guy. Wow, that was weird. It looked like he was going to glitch me into the ground for a second. Oof. I jumped a little early there. Uh, that looks like a secret if I've ever seen it. But there's nothing up there, so never mind. Ooh! I landed close enough to the ground where I couldn't spin jump off the piranha plant, but I, um, the piranha plant also wasn't fully under, so it killed me. That's always a pain in the ass. There's, like, not a very big window of time where that can happen, I don't think. But sometimes it seems to happen. Your timing is bad like me. Oh, that's right. I forgot that you are immune to shells. Strange properties of the Dino Rhino. Okay. I like the little frog creatures that they've become, though. What is this? What do I need this for? I'm really confused at to why I would have that. After going in this pipe, you'll get to another one. Do not wor worry about what will happen, just enjoy your flight. Do I'm not touching the buttons, I guess? Um, okay. So just don't touch buttons is what I'm assuming. I'm assuming it's an automated part. Nope. <laughs> I figured, like, don't worry about what happened was like a tactful way of saying you're gonna bounce around at a bunch of crazy things. But that's cool with me. I don't really like automated levels too much. What the hell am I supposed to do with this? Well, I only meant to land on the platform to see if something happened behind it, but I guess we ended the level, so we'll never know what that P-Switch does. That's... unfortunate. Okay, so we're at Jolly Ro Roger Lacoon. I think it's just R-O-G-E-R. -E I'm not sure, but that's fine. Welcome. Here squid and other watery foes live. Some say there is a ghost ship around here, but that's a rumor. That sound doesn't sound like a rumor. Why would you mention it? Okay. <laughs> that's that's kind of silly. I can dig it, though. Oh, I did not make my jump. And there we are. Okay, we needed that Mario coin. Okay. I really would like another hit. Get rid of the Galoomba, and we'll keep the shell. Okay. Damn it. People are crowding my space. Oh, my. I, I had a kind of a panic there. Let's see if this goes better. There we are. Oh, my. Ugh. Ah, uh, frustrating. Yeah, fuck that dude. Now we despawn the shell. And that is as safe as we can make getting this mushroom. <laughs> it's sad that it's come to this, but you know, you gotta realize your shortcomings. If you suck, you gotta fucking deal with it. It's a part of life. I thought for sure there would be ground down there because I saw the pipe, but I didn't realize I was at the bottom of the screen. Oh, man. Hey, you killed my shell, you bastard. I wanted that. Ooh, we got a mushroom in there, I think. That's well received. Oops. It's definitely well received. I don't know why I would go back for that. It's not like that block's gonna be anything good when it's next to a mushroom. Gonna put two power-ups in there, what? Okay. So, oh god, here we go. That actually was not not difficult at all. For some reason I thought there was gonna be a good chance of me falling through to the bottom side, but it was really easy to avoid. This cave's not so bad, I like it. Again, it gives me, I think it was this episode I was talking about it in. It gives me the feel of an actual, um, actual Mario game. Like, I could be playing Super Mario World that was made recently. Oh, come on now. 
I really didn't mean to do that, but um... If that other info box said that a ghost ship is a rumor, then he sucks. There is one, and you can get to it using the next pipe. Is this the secret way? Um, was there like a different way that I didn't go? Oh... God, that was stupid of me. But at least we can try again right away. One try again. Oh my goodness, all for this. Don't even have the other coins anymore. Yes, yes, come Mr. Urchin. Wow. I tried to fast forward it a little bit, but uh... I could not keep up with the button pressing, so I sank alarmingly fast. I'm glad I didn't try that for more than a second. Please don't send me back too many levels. Please. Uh, one? Oh, that's not so bad. Alright, so we made it back with some fireballs. And this is going to make things much easier, I predict. No more of this, all this bullshit with people. Squids running into me. Getting pushed around by squids all the fucking time. I <laughs> can't kill them or damage them in any way. Fuck that. Now we got fireballs. Yeah, burn both of you individually and kill your squid. And more fireballs. We don't even need them. Did I just shoot that into the ceiling? I think I did. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if you could use that in some way. Something useful. For like a puzzle. Being able to shoot a fireball through a wall could hit a shell or something and turn it into a coin for Yoshi, because it would move. Something like that. Could be interesting. Alright. Two fireballs to him. Oh. There we go. Still got one, so we should be fine. For now. Nice easy part. Midway point, and I think this is where we left off. Oh, wow. My timing is awful. That was just pitiful. I can't even excuse that. Please hit that guy. God damn. Okay, yeah, we'll <laughs> just keep moving fast. Fuck this dude. I didn't want to do that. Okay. Give me the shell, please. Thank you. Alright. That info box said there's a ghost ship. Oh yeah, I recall your your little message. Get the shell back. Just in case we're going underwater, which I believe we will be. We are. So now we can swim nice and fast with our shell. Not going to get the coins because I missed the other ones. Or died, rather. <laughs> Okay, so far not so bad. That was the pretty, pretty simple ghost ship, but it looks nice, you know what I mean? It's got a nice atmosphere. That's what I really like, he took a lot of care to make sure the levels looked and played nice. It's hard to do. What do we got here? Spoogleman, Spoogle Moon Bay. Well, isn't that something? Oh, actually, I'm sorry to taunt you folks, but we're gonna have to call it an episode. We'll pick up right here at the beginning of this auto-scroller next time. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching, and I hope you have a great day. I'm so bad at drums.